Hi everybody. So today, what I want to talk about real quick is this author, Jude Devereux. This is her brand new book. It's called Lavender Morning, and it is actually going to be book one in a new series by her. I haven't read this book yet. I'm in the middle of reading another book. I've actually, I haven't posted a book review lately. I've read about four or five books since my last one that just haven't been worth telling you about. Um, I wouldn't recommend them, so I'm not going to tell you about them. Um, the, I'm finishing the book I'm reading now, and then I'm going to get to this Jude Devereux book. And all I have to say is, look at her name again. Any book by this woman you are going to love. Um, if you like historical fiction books, she does have, if, if you go to your library or your bookstore and you look at her books, her more historical fiction type books, kind of her lovey-dovey romancy sort of ones, but with kind of powerful, strong, kind of heroine characters in them, um, those books, Knight in Shining Armor is my favorite one. And I know it sounds funny, like, ooh, it's a hero, yada, yada. But it's actually not so much about that. It's kind of about, um, it was kind of weird because it was going from um, the present to the past, future, whatever. It was going back and forth. It was time travel a little bit with a knight who, like, is brought into the present day and how he has to deal with that. And then she ends up going. And um, it is a love story in a way. But, oh, that one was cute. It was funny. I liked it. And then she's got some Velvet series ones. Um, she does a lot of books about clans and Scottish clans. Um, I think it's Scotland, yeah. And versus England and things like that. So back in that day. And those are really cute because she sort of uses a lot of the same names like Montgomery, Rain. Ooh, there's another last name. Oh, the Montgomery versus. It's sort of the T, I think. Ah, there's like these two like kind of families, the Montgomerys and somebody else, and they're just like, it's not like a war going on, but some people like the Montgomery men better, and some people like the, oh, so long ago when I read these books, the other men better, and because some are rich, but some are manly, and they're, oh, and there's some like old Wild West sort of, so, like Gold Rush times, there's a couple of those books, a couple of them do have the time travel in it too. And then she does have a whole bunch of books where they're present day. Um, I'm just trying to remember. I think it says in here, Return to the Summer House. That's a really good book. Um, Wild Orchids. Yeah, I like that one a lot. Holly, Mulberry Tree, The Summer House, Temptation. Temptation was one of the more historical ones, I believe. Every single book that I have read by this woman, I have loved. I found her books just by accident. Read one, then read them all. Every single one my library had. Um, this one just came in, so I just got it. And I haven't read it yet. Like I said, when I do, I will give a review of it. How about that? And how about if you guys want to, if you've read any Jude Devereux books, post a comment and tell me which one of her books was your favorite book. Or tell me which one of the characters was your favorite. Are you a Montgomery girl? Or are you, oh god, ah, it starts with a T, or are you other girl, um, or boy, if you read their books, I don't care, and so yeah, check these out right now, seriously, turn this video off, go to your library or your bookstore, open a book, any book by her, start reading the first few, like, words of the chapter, and you're going to be hooked. She writes really, really well. It says on the back here, um, any novel by Jude Devereux is just plain fun to read, and she keeps the readers on the edge of her seat. True. Master storyteller. True. She's very good at storytelling. Um, she's always enchanted her readers. She instinctively knows what every woman is searching for. Her own knight in shining armor. <laughs> That's cute. Um, her writing is exquisite and enchanting. Blah, blah, blah. Phenomenal. I just can't say enough good stuff about this author. If you're watching... Jude, you are a phenomenal writer, and I love your books. Write more, write faster. Yay. <laughs> All right, everyone. Go enjoy those books. I'll see you later.